Business uh, in India has been asking for lower interest rates for, for a long time, and uh, Raghuram Rajan and the central bank have been uh, resisting because inflation has been so high. But finally, um, the inflation numbers have started to come down quite drastically, actually, uh, partly because of lower food prices, and, and we're beginning to see um, the effects of lower oil prices. Raghuram Rajan had said he wasn't necessarily going to make these announcements or these interest rate changes um, at the regular meetings that the, that the central bank has. Um, of course, the timing, nobody knew when it would happen, but the fact that it happened on an un unscheduled day was, was not a complete surprise. But obviously, the markets were pleased. Uh, the, the stock market in India went up pretty rapidly. Um, and uh, the business community is certainly going to be delighted because this is the start of a of a longer, steady process, uh, almost certainly, of interest rate decline in India. India is the last major economy uh, to, to face the problem of collapsing inflation. Or, of course, in India it's not a problem because inflation has been so high. It's been very different from other economies in that sense. This should provide a boost to the economy and foreign investors uh, and whether they're investing in the, in the stock market or whether they're direct investors in industry uh, are, are going to want to take advantage of this. And it shouldn't be uh, too long, uh, maybe a year or so, before uh, the Indian economy is within sight of overtaking uh, China in terms of the rate of economic growth.